Hi, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Today is the class number 15. <laughs> One more class. Woo. More. Tomorrow is the last class. Yes, sir. That's right. Okay. Welcome, everybody. I hope you're ready. Ready, ready. Yeah. With full battery. Full energy. Okay, I see some people are ready. I see some other people are not. <laughs> we need the cameras, remember? Yes. Okay, so it's also a good idea to remind about the platform. Tomorrow has to be finished, the test. Yes. The yes. last test. Yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, welcome everybody. How was your day? What did you do? Anything special? Any good news? Any bad news? <laughs> no? Everything good? Everything okay? Today I mean, is okay. Everything was okay. okay. All right, that's great. That's awesome. That's good to hear. Okay. Nice. Well, do you have any question about vocabulary or something that you don't understand or something that you still say oh what do i say here what do i do here especially in the exercises that you are completing on the platform or the exercises are understandable i finished the platform teacher. oh nice that's good congratulations yes. i finished the platform oh. I I have my certificate. My diploma, Your diploma. My certificate. What's that? Well, well, <laughs> that's good news. And I ask you, any good news? Yeah, no, normal. <laughs> 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 and that is good news. That is awesome. That is nice. Yes. Okay. Congratulations. Keep it up. Keep Thank working you. hard. Yes. That's the way. That's the way you should do things. Yes always the best effort always the best of the best the best you can do it's gonna give you satisfaction because you say yeah i did my best i did all my effort my biggest effort i gave all my energy my concentration and i'm happy and i'm glad that i'm learning right so that's really good okay well let's get started let's get this party started Okay. <laughs> Did you have dinner already? Did you have a good dinner? No, yet. not yet. Oh, not, know? Yet. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. So you usually have dinner after class. Yes. Okay. Yes. More relaxed. <laughs> More relaxed. More relaxed. Okay. Nice. I, I, I was eat a uh, uh, sandwich. Oh, you were um, eating a sandwich. A few minutes ago. Ago. Oh, yeah. nice. That's good. At least you are not empty. <laughs> Stomach. <laughs> yes, I know. Stomach emptied, probably. Okay, good. Well, let me just share my PowerPoint. It's right here. You got it. And just one more thing. Yes, here we go. So this is our class number 15 mm -hmm. and woo, <laughs> the idea today is that you describe your childhood memories. That's nice. You have to make memories. Oh, when I was six years old, I started school. When I was a child, I lived with my grandparents. So you have to describe your memories, okay? So this is the objective, okay, to describe childhood memories by using the verb be in past, right? Which is was, where, of course. Uh -huh. And now <laughs> let's start talking about your childhood. I know you need to prepare, for example. Okay, I was born, as I told you, in Cabañas, 
but I didn't grow up in Cabañas because my parents moved to a town called Huazapa, which is near Aguilares, I think. So I grew up there. I was, uh, yes, I was a kid and we used to live by La Troncal del Norte. So <laughs> my father was a farmer and my mom was um, a housewife. So we grew up, my three brothers and I, and we went to school in a little school near the area. When I was a kid, I was very shy. I was nothing compared to today. <laughs> I was very different. I, I was all the time with my brother because my brother was an older brother, so he would protect me. So my mom was very, very protective too. She was very careful with us. So she took care of us. She sent us to school, but she was always like really careful. She was waiting for us. And that was some of the memories I had. We lived in a farm. We had a lot of fruits, trees. We used to get coconuts, mangoes, oranges. We, we had a happy childhood. I would say we used to play a lot. My brothers used to play cars, used to play soccer, used to, they used to play a lot of games, high and seek. And I think that was, uh, yeah, at school I, I was, I was very shy, but at the same time I was, I was very responsible. I was very, let's say, curious and smart. So my teachers were very happy with me and I usually got uh, a diploma or an award at the end of the year because I was kind of the best student. So <laughs> my school was little. So uh, I finished studying until, I'm sorry if it is very noisy here, but I have some neighbors and they have a kind of a celebration. So my school was little, so I finished third grade there and then I moved to another school. So in that school was a little bit more difficult because it was a bigger school. The education was more demanding, but I was still good. I was still a good student. And then I finished there and my parents returned to their hometown. Not exactly to the place where I was born, but to Ilovasco, to another city close because my grandparents live there. So they have land and they have some houses. So will return to live there, but that is basically my childhood. That is only an example. Okay, todo esto yo que yo les he contado no lo van a hacer así ustedes porque you had a different experience, of course, right? Yes. Okay, pero the idea, okay? The idea, so, yes. About your family, about your friends, about your school, and that's what you're gonna do. No me lo van a decir ahorita porque it's not possible, right? So I'm gonna give you some minutes to practice, okay? At least, three, four sentences. I, when I was six years old, I entered to kindergarten. Oh, when I was uh, a child, my brothers were really happy because I was the baby. I don't know, whatever you want to say, okay? So, for practice, para que practiquen y como contar sobre su childhood, childhood significa niñez, le vamos a dar chance. Yes. So you practice a little bit with your partners. And then, Listen, listen to the happy family. <laughs> so when we come back to the main session, we are going to share in the general meeting, okay? You're gonna say, please, let's listen to Margarita's story. Margarita's childhood was very interesting. Oh no, let's listen to Oscar's story. He had very, uh, he has very interesting uh, memories. So we're gonna choose, okay? Ustedes mismos van a, Select or choose or pick your partner, el que más le haya llamado la atención. Yes? Clear? Clear. Oh, thank God. <laughs> because my neighbors. <laughs> All right. Let me make the rooms. So, in groups of three, right? In the mini minimo, catch a chicken by the toe. We're going to make five groups.
Pues dijo que iba a ser grupo dos, pero creo que nos tocó de dos. Ok. Bueno, in inicias tú. Ok. <ríe> uh, ok. Uh, when I was two, I remember the... Vale, si quieres comienzo yo ahorita. When I was a child... Uh, I played with my Barbies all day, every day. <laughs> I played. Played, jugar, en pasado, no? Played. Yes. Yes. Played. Uh, played with mm -hmm. my Barbies all day. Mm -hmm. Now you. Uh, when I was chill, I remember that I played with my <laughs> uh, I had a, a toy uh, of Max Steel. <laughs> what is this? Max Steel is uh, a <laughs> it's like a um, Barbie. You for boy. Ah, eh, como tu muñeco, so un superhéroe. Uh, Yes. Ah, ok. <laughs> It's like... ¿Cómo se dice en inglés? Este... Creo que... No sé. Yo solo a high school lo digo que le dicen siempre. Por aquí está mejor, pero voy a dejar que... La escuela básica, teacher, ¿cómo se dice? High school es ya como el bachillerato. La básica es primary school. Primary. 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 Ah, primary. primary. Es como la primaria, exactly. Primary Pensé school. Pensé que primary, dije yo. Ay, <laughs> That's another school. Well, no. Pero igual se gasta. <laughs> yes. <laughs> primary school, yes. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Sí, pero igual yo creo que tiene que ser así un poquito más, más extenso. Okay. okay. It's your turn, Oscar. Oh, oh, me va a costar. Yo tengo memoria de pez. <ríe> me recuerdo mucho. Bueno, mm, me, mm, bueno, voy a ver cómo, cómo, cómo la formulo porque mi inglés es malísimo. It's not very good. <ríe> oh my God. No, en mi salud, hay. ¿Cómo me disfruté? ¿De uh, delight o.? Enjoyed. Enjoyed. Enjoy. Ah, okay. enjoy. I, I, I enjoy. enjoy my childhood. Enjoy. Okay. Enjoy my childhood. Um, um, with my brothers. And. Um, ¿Cómo se? Es que no recuerdo. No, recuerdo. No, no jugaba con vecinos, pero only my brothers. Um, de my kindergarten. Um, Quizás, por ejemplo, um, <laughs> I am Erika Leandra. 
I was born on March eh, 28, eh, 1995 in the Sun Hospital. Um, my mother was born in, no sé si, Mexicanos. No sé si así, Mexicanos, ¿no? <ríe> Son sí. Salvador. Sí, los lugares generalmente no cambian el nombre. Yes. Uh, my father in Dolores City, Cabaña. Mm, when I was born, uh, my mother was very Hola, young. Es, no escuché de cuántas líneas lo íbamos a hacer. Uh, Independiente. Eso. No, yo no sé, creo que no. Yeah. <laughs> Al menos cuatro o cinco oraciones. Four or five sentences. Ah, uh, ok. Uh -huh. oh. Yes, no problem. Oh, ok. Uh -huh. Ahí está la teacher, ¿no? If you can say more, no problem, ok. Me <laughs> vengo <laughs> de incógnita. <laughs> But I see you. Vale. Ok. Tu el con continuo, Erika. Ok. Uh -huh. <laughs> When... Uh, when I was child, I remember that I went in our holidays. Uh -huh. uh, to To the, to the beach, to the volcano, beach. to the mountain. <laughs> What happened, Brian? <laughs> <laughs> I need the vocabulary. Okay, yes. <laughs> I could say the beach, uh -huh. but I didn't. No, I don't. No, no I can swim. Uh, say no, I can say. Uh, that I went to a uh, volcano because I didn't do that. Mm -hmm. Okay. When I was a child, I visit I visited uh, the wood, the impossible wood, el bosque impossible, el bosque impossible. Uh, impossible wood, wood. It uh, could be el impossible normal because no no se no se deben cambiar los nombres propios, pero podría okay. ser el imposible forest. El imposible forest. Okay. Mm -hmm. no, es que the woods es como más así como, ay, como el bosque de los siete acres, como el bosque de, de lobo feroz, como más así the woods. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you can say the forest. Okay. Mm -hmm. The imposible forest. Okay, when I was a child, I liked to... <laughs> right now, I don't like sweet. I don't like candy. I don't remember. <laughs> and now, and now you, you eat uh, berry candy? No, I don't no. like sweet. Okay. Me I too. don't like candy. <laughs> Anything sweet. Any uh -huh. <laughs> you were mucho no alargamos con Mr. Urias. No, no le dimos chance a Miriam. Pero... Oh my god. <laughs> Excuse me, Miriam. Miriam, perdón. Era mi culpa. Forgive me. De Lam no pasaba. No pasaba yo de Lam. Le... I promise. Yeah. Quiet, be quiet. No problem, no problem. Guys. Solo por eso que sea la primera. En mi, exactly, Miriam. Oh, I'm the volunteer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I see you have very interesting stories, very interesting memories from your childhood. Some people used to play with superheroes. Some people used to play with Barbie dolls. Some people used to 
um, have a lot of candies, <laughs> okay? Vaya nomás spoilers, okay? Well, some people have very nice stories, okay? So, from group number one, let's see, who was the room number one? It was Julia, Miss Carla Palacios, Margarita, and Wendy, aha. Uh -huh. Who do you want to listen? De ellos cuatro. Julia, Carla, Margarita, or Wendy? Uh, Julia. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> All right, go ahead. I was born on June uh, <coughs> 1996 mm -hmm. in Salco, Sonsonate. I was studying in the same city. When I was finished the high school, I want to go, I want to, to went. You wanted the, to go. You wanted, ah, okay. I wanted to go. I want to, to go in the military school and I tried, but they didn't accept me, accept me because I can't swim. Swim. Ouch. So you were not <laughs> accepted in the military school because you cannot swim. Did you learn to swim? Uh, yes, but it's a large distance and uh, me can say. I got tired. Uh -huh, but I, I don't, I don't do the, the test. Distance, uh-huh. Yeah, you couldn't reach the test. I mean, the, yes, the distance that they require. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, what did you do that? I mean, after that. Uh, actually, I studied uh, in agronomy engineer. Really? Yes. And, and, and engineering uh, in agronomy. That's nice. The last year, I I res I, I finished. I finished all yes. the subjects. And now you're working in your thesis project. Um, uh, no, I do the, I will do the thesis. Uh-huh. This uh, year. Uh-huh, this year. Yeah, you will work on your thesis project this year. Wow, did you study at Universidad de Salvador? Yes, yes. Nice, so you were near uh, San Luis Talpa. Uh-huh, sí. They have the campus for agronomy there because I used to work for the, university and I and I went to that campus uh, let's see two or three years ago because we were working on an investigation project and we have uh, students from from the place too that's nice awesome good congratulations you see you have very nice story so you have a future engineer in agronomy that's really awesome because we all need people who produce food who plant right so we need cereals we need rice we need corn we need beans and we need uh, other food like meats and fish and all those things that they are in charge of that's really awesome nice okay let's see from the group number two we had gabriela noemi and wilson uh-huh choose one select one me Okay, go ahead. Um, when I was younger, I used to play to football and the dolls with my sister and my friends at my house. I'm very happy I, I did do it. You, you're very happy that you used to play with your sister, your brothers, okay? Yes. So, no worries <laughs> when you were a child. <laughs> no. You uh, didn't have to pay the rent, the electricity, the internet, no. <laughs> nothing. Uh, no, I, I, yo tengo. I, I, I have. I have uh, five sisters and four brothers. Oh my God. You come from yes. a very big family. Yes. Only that was ten. a party every day in your house. Yes, yes. <laughs> No había necesidad de amigos. That's nice. Actually, 
<laughs> yeah, you you had a happy childhood. Yes. I'm yes. very happy. Y no lo sabíamos. <laughs> exactly. We were happy and we didn't we know. We were happy and yes. did not. And we didn't know. And we no. didn't know. Oh. That's true. Wow, Noemi, thank you for sharing. <laughs> you see, You're welcome. you surprised me. And I'm impressed. Okay, from the group number three, we have Luis, Alan, Zuria, Miriam, and Oscar. I bet Miriam because she didn't okay, participate. Miriam. Yes. <laughs> Democracy. <Yeah. laughs> Miriam, Miriam. I know. I know. <laughs> okay. Mm, okay. I had a pretty um, childhood. Because I very, how do you say, um, consentida, una niña spoiled. S P O I L E D, spoiled, como pampered. Spoiled. Yes, spoiled uh -huh. or pampered. Mm -hmm. Because when um, I was born, I was the first. Uh, daughter, the, fair, the first um, granddaughter. Um, <laughs> yes, 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 yes. And when I grew up, um, I had only uh, boys, um, cousin boys. Uh -huh. Yes. And my, um, my, what? Your grandparents? Uh, neighbor, your, oh, your neighbors. Neighbor, neighbors, um, uh, there were only boys. So, oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> so when I, I was uh, play with them, um, I told them, uh, they had to play with me with Barbies. <laughs> <laughs> you pushed and, them to play Barbies. Yes. <laughs> and, and, and then um, they me hacían caso. They accepted. Yes. <laughs> and, Manipulated. Um, <laughs> yes. And I and I told them. Uh, they uh, today uh, they um, you have to play with me and you are uh, you was can and 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 I uh, I was play Barbie and and ahí los tenía <laughs> <laughs> all the kids there <laughs> the long the long time 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 oh my god and, and then. Um, I I grow up and I am um, study and uh, only in a, in a school that uh, there were only only girls and I I. Graduate my graduation. You graduated. Um, uh -huh. Graduated. Um, it was very very nice, and I I went to the the university, and I um chose chose I chose I lehi. Yeah, I chose. I chose um. I, I, I don't I don't know how do you say licenciatura en educación parvularia. <laughs> a major <laughs> in education. Yes. A major um, in education for kids. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I am a teacher, but uh, only only kids, baby, babies, babies. Very little, and, very young. Yeah. Yes. And, and now you don't make your, your students play with Barbies anymore. 
<laughs> Imagine yeah. today's activity is going to be. <laughs> okay. yeah. No, please. <laughs> no, actually, yeah. kids nowadays they they don't play with those games anymore. They have very different games. <laughs> okay. In the in the in the, yeah. in the next in, in the next meeting, Oscar and I uh, play with Miriam with the <laughs> with the Barbie. The, your, <laughs> The yes, okay. okay. No, no, no Mortal please. Kombat. <laughs> <laughs> and next, play the soccer, please. All right. Mm -hmm. From group number four, we have Brian and Claudia. Who's going to participate? Uh-huh. <laughs> Only one. <laughs> Claudia's waiting that Brian says me. Brian is waiting that Claudia <laughs> says me too. <laughs> yes. I'm a very shy teacher. I'm a very shy person. No, go ahead, Claudia. <laughs> I heard your story. Brian que sea un caballero. <laughs> That's why he said ladies first. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, <Esther>. Okay. <laughs> uh, um, I had a interesting childhood, a very happy childhood, because I have a lot of moments that I can say uh, it's it's perfect um, because um, I remember that when I was child I liked to ride my bike with my neighbors um, uh -huh. every afternoon afternoon mm -hmm. every friday uh -huh. um, another thing that i remember i liked to go to visit my great grandmother i visited uh, her with my grandmother Wow. Um, another day, uh, we went with my sister. And it's another thing that I told uh, Claudia, Claudia mm -hmm. that my sister, uh, when she was a child, uh, she had a lot of accidents. Uh, Oh my God. In my case, I used to take care of her. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And I didn't have uh, accident, any accident. Use algunos, uh, como se dice? Some. And some, uh, like uh, I have, um, what is it? You cut here. Cicatrices de scars, pero dice, yo me corté acá. I cut here. Uh, I cut here. Uh, because when I was child, I remember that I have a skateboard. Mm -hmm. And I do an... tricks. Tricks. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You were very uh, uh, extreme with a bike, with a skateboard. Yes, I like to do that. Tricks. <laughs> Uh, wow. tricks. <laughs> and twist and turns. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. that's interesting. Thank you, Brian, for sharing. And the last group was Erica, Flor, Ricardo, and Wendy. Uh -huh. Just one, please. Okay, teacher, me. Go ahead. Wendy. Um, I record, I remember when I was a child, I lived with my grandmother. Hey, my two brother. I have a two brother. How do you say menores? Younger than me. Younger at me. 
Mm -hmm. I live I live uh, in a city, San Martin City. I record she prepare uh, my grandmother prepare. I I record my grandmother prepare every day to go to school. But I but uh, I I don't like it every day very early. early. Mm -hmm. Yes, and when I was um. When I have a uh, 10 years old. When I was 10 uh, years old. When I was 10 years old, mm -hmm. uh, I traveled all the place with my parents. Mm, only only with my mom and my and my dad. But um, I miss my grandmother. I miss mm. my grandmother. That's so sweet. Oh my God, so you grew up <laughs> with your grandma. Yes, I remember when I was a, a child, also when I was a little girl, I was the favorite granddaughter of my grandfather on my mom's side because my grandma had 11 kids with nine boys and only two girls. And my mom was one of those girls. So my mom had three boys and only one girl that was me so my grandpa used to visit us like very often and he always brought me something he always brought cheese he always brought fruit or something but he always gave it to me so he says no se lo vamos a dar a la niña and i was like okay <laughs> so i always have to wait for my grandpa when he visited the home so it was interesting yeah my grandpa used to leave 90, 95 years old. He passed away about, let's see, 10 years ago. But he lived a very long life. He was a nice man. He was a great man. Okay, yes. you see. In my case, uh, my, my grandmother, she died two days ago. Today is true. You told me. Our condolences, Wendy, okay? Yeah. You were a great Thank granddaughter you. to your grandma, so she'll be in heaven. It's true, you told it's, them. It's the same with my mom. All right. Okay. Well, let's move on. We still have, uh, yes, we still have the presentation. We haven't covered much, but we have enjoyed listening to your stories, definitely. Okay. So one second, please. All right, we're just gonna practice these short conversations. Yes, I hope you can yes, see the presentation. And it says, this is the contrast. You see that we use with the verb being past and the other verbs, right? Go, play, study, cook, dance, whatever. For this other verse in negative, we use did, didn't, right? Didn't. And for the verb to be, we don't use any auxiliary. So the example here says, did you sleep well last night? Because sleep yes. is an action verb, right? So did you sleep well last night? Yes, I did. I was very tired. Yes. So did you sleep well last night? Sí, dormí bien porque estaba bien cansado, right? So I was tired. So in the second example, did Roger sleep well last night? No, he didn't. He wasn't tired. So you see, it's very similar, okay? Did you yes. sleep well last night? Yes, I did. Te estoy preguntando con el auxiliary did. La respuesta corta también es con el mismo auxiliary. Yes? Did you sleep well last night? Yes, I did. I was tired. Did Roger sleep well last night? No, he didn't. He wasn't tired. Okay? So we're going to have to practice some very similar questions here. Did Frank have a big breakfast today? Yes. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He? He, he was, he, he he was hungry. He was hungry. He said, I am hungry. I was hungry. Yes, I am tired. I was tired. 
I am sleepy. I was sleepy. Como estas formas de sentir las emociones siempre va a ser, no es yo tengo hambre, como en español, sino que es yo es, me siento, estoy hambriento. Yes? So, did Frank have a big breakfast today? Yes, he did. He was hungry. Yes, he, did. he was hungry. Ok, y ahí ven el big breakfast, ¿verdad? Okay. Yes. <laughs> did, en, en estas imágenes es súper importante que le presten atención como a los detallitos, ¿verdad? So, para que le, le sepa guiar mejor la idea. Ok. Did Telma have a big breakfast today? No, no she didn't. No, she didn't. She didn't. She wasn't. She was very hungry. hungry. She ella wasn't no tuvo un big breakfast porque ella no estaba hambrienta. She wasn't hungry. Yes? Okay. Did Mr. Shen go to the doctor yesterday? Yes. yes. He did. Yes, he did. He? He was sick. He was sick. He was sick. Yeah, él estaba enfermo. So, did Mr. Sick. Shen go to the doctor yesterday? Yes, he did. He was sick. All right. Did Mrs. Shen go to the doctor yesterday? No. No, he no, didn't. She didn't. No, she didn't. She, she wasn't sick. She wasn't sick. She wasn't she sick. Yeah, no, no fue. Ella no estaba enferma, right? So, no, she didn't. She wasn't she sick. Didn't. She wasn't. Okay. okay. Did Billy finish his milk? Yes. 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 He did. Yes, he did. He was thirsty. He was thirsty. He was thirsty. thirsty. He was thirsty. 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 Yes. Did Kathy finish her milk? No. No, she, she didn't. didn't. She didn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. Mm -hmm. Thirsty. Okay. Thirsty. I just have a question. ¿Se logra leer la, la, la parte de abajo? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Did Sonia miss the train? Miss the train? <laughs> Se yes. le fue el train. Yes. She did. Yes. She did. She did. She was late. She was she late. She was late. No, she was late. Por she eso was se late. Le fue yes. Exactly. She so, was did late. Sonia yes. miss the train? Yes, she did. She was late. Yes, she did. She was late. Yes. She did the steward miss the train? No. No, no he didn't. No, he didn't. He, he wasn't late. He wasn't late. He wasn't late. Yeah, he wasn't late. Yeah, él no, no perdió he el tren late. porque él no, no llegó tarde, él llegó a tiempo, right? Okay. okay. So this is just to make the transition. You can see that we can use the other verbs in past with the verb to be. Okay. So no es que vamos a usar separado el verb to be y separado los otros verbos en pasado. No. Puede usarse todo junto. Como cuando yo les empecé a contar... I grew up in Guasapa. I grew up near La Troncal del Norte. I was a happy child. I was very shy. Very shy means uh, penosa, right? So, in contrast, se tiende a estudiar por separado porque tienen sus propias reglas. The other verse need the auxiliary did or didn't for the negative or for the questions. And the verb to be doesn't need any auxiliary. Yes? But then when you talk, cuando ustedes narran cosas en pasado, obviously you're going to need action verbs. Y también van a necesitar el verb to be, que es un verbo de estado. Yes? A state verb. Okay. So we already practiced this conversation. And now I have this explanation. Vamos a ver. So déjenme mover estas bars right here. So... We have these information questions. Si se fijan, las primeras tres de arriba, necesito un auxiliary. Yes? El auxiliary did. Y las tres de abajo, no necesito un auxiliary porque el verb to be se auxilia solo. Yes? Solo lo paso antes del sujeto. Entonces, where did you grow up? Where did you grow up? Grow up significa crecer. Ok, aquí grow up es en base form porque ya tengo el auxiliary, right? Yeah. Where did you grow up? 
I grew up in Texas. Yes. Aquí sí ya lo pongo en past porque estoy haciendo la oración affirmative. Right? Where did you grow up? I grew up in Texas. When did you come to Los Angeles? I came to Los Angeles in 1990. Why did you become a hairstylist? Because I needed the money. Perfect. Now, these questions with the verb be in past. How old were you in 1990? I was 18. What was your major in college? It was drama. How was college? It was great. For example, how old were you in 2010? I was 15, I was 20, I was 30, I don't know. What was your major in college? Es como lo que pregunto Miriam, ¿cuál era la carrera en educación? So, aquí yo le podría decir, oh, your major in college. College no es colegio, no lo traduzcamos literalmente. College mm -hmm. is university. university. So, yes, my major was education. You can say that. Or I major in education. Or my major was education. Okay, how was college? También podría ser, how was school? How was your childhood? ¿Cómo fue? ¿Cómo fue tu, tu infancia? ¿Cómo fue tu escuela primaria? It was great, it was fun, it was interesting, it was entertaining, it was crazy. Like um, Margarita's childhood, it was full of fun, full of entertainment because she had a lot of brothers and sisters. So she said, how was your childhood, Margarita? And she said, oh, it was so crazy, it was funny. It was real entertaining, yes? Mm -hmm. okay. okay, bye. Now, dependiendo de lo que está acá, y siguiendo, obviously, estas reglas, cuando voy a usar un verb to be, no necesito auxilio. Simplemente lo digo antes del subject para estructurar la question. Ahora tenemos aquí un grupo de questions. Algunas con where, was, y otras con did, in past, right? In the verb. Ok, vamos a match. ¿Cuál sería la respuesta correcta para cada una de estas questions? Eso lo vamos a discutir en los grupos y yo les voy a compartir el screenshot. Don't worry. Okay? In the same rooms. In the same groups que ya estaban trabajando. Y acá tenemos a Mr. Edgar and a sign. Lo vamos a mandar al room number four que solo tenía two people. Ok. No. Sí, solo que está pequeño. Ah, oh, pero caray. Yes, ahí sí. Ok. Uh, yes. Because I stay in my phone. <laughs> ok. Ok. Ok, the number one. Number one. Where, 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 where are you? For letter C, I was born in 1983 in Hiroshima, Japan. Number two, 
Where, uh, did, where did you grow up? It's F. Letter F. Letter S. I grew up in Tokyo. Okay. Number three. When do you start school? When do you start? I entered first first grade in. 1989. I think that would be G. G. I interest first grade, sí. G. Sería la letra G. Number four. Let me see, how old were you then? How are you then? ¿Qué edad tenías? Creo. Mm. Creo que sí. Sería la H. Mm. La H. It was seis años, ¿verdad? Yes. Es la Ajá. A. Letter A, yes. Number Letter four. A. How Number old four. were you then? How, How old were you then? then? ¿Cuántos años tenían ellos? You then. Then? Ah, o después. Sí, ¿verdad? Y how old were you then? En en that case el then es como ¿y qué edad tenías entonces? Uh -huh. Ah. Uh -huh. Ya yeah, then puede ser también luego, pero en este caso es como en ese entonces. Teacher, entonces la number three, eh, la respuesta es la la letter G. Okay. Read the question. When did you start school? Uh -huh. When did you start school? Uh, let's see, when did you start school? That is number three. Yes, right? Mm -hmm. No. I entered first grade in 1989. Yes, en, en, entré o inicié... Ajá, letter G. Entré o inicié en primer grado en ese año. Letter G, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. And number four is... I was six, verdad? Yes, I was six. I was six. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. How was your no. first day of school? It, it was, was a little, little scary. It was a little scary. It was a little scary. Yes. Letter H. And uh, number six. Who was your? Okay. Repeat. Again? Repeat again? Repetimos. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, when I when when and where were you born? I was born in 1983 in Hiroshima, Japan. Okay, two. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Tokyo. Okay. Uh, when did you start school? I, it was, no, perdón. Se, sería. I entered first grade in uh, 1999. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? <laughs> 1999. 
finished? Finished. Yes, great. <laughs> you finished the exercise. Good. Let's have it right here. Okay. So let's see. Let's have the. Um, wait a second. Let's have the text. <laughs> All right. Number one. When and where were you born? The definitely is letter C. I was born in 1983 in Hiroshima, Japan. Where did you grow up? Letter F. Letter F. F. Letter F. Uh-huh. I grew up in Tokyo. In Tokyo. In Tokyo. Yes. Okay. When did you start school? Letter G. Letter G. Letter G. G. Letter G. Uh -huh. I enter first grade. I enter grade. first grade in, in 1989. 1989. Exactly. 89. How old were you then? Letter, Letter A. 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 Letter A. I was. I was six. six. Uh -huh. How old were you when you entered school? Letter I was H. Six. No, I was uh, six. No. Uh -huh. I was three. I was three. three. I was four. Uh -huh. Todos oh. iniciamos como a diferentes edades. Ahí dependía nuestros padres, ¿verdad? Yeah. Yes. yes, some of our parents send us when we were six, five, or four, but some others when we were seven, probably. Okay, how was your first day of school? Uh -huh. How was your first day of school? It was a little scary. It was a little scary. It was fine. It was okay. It was funny. It was mm -hmm. ¿Cómo fue tu primer día de escuela? Yes. How was your first experience at school? <laughs> it was excellent. It was incredible. Yes, it was wonderful. Incredible. I yeah. cried. Fantastic. <laughs> it was fantastic. I fantastic. cried. All right. Who was your first friend in school? Letter D. Her name was Her name was Who was your first friend at school? Oh, her name was Jumiko. My First friend at school was Sylvia. I still remember her. <laughs> she was like my older sister because I never had a sister. Okay, what well, was he or she like? Letter B. Letter B. She was? A really shy. Really shy. She was really shy. Era yes. muy tímida. Okay, why did you take this class? <laughs> this is a serious question. My English very good. My English wasn't very good. Ustedes no sé, bueno, los más de mí, de mi época recordarán a Celia Cruz. Do you remember? Yes, teacher. Celia? Yes. 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 Los mm -hmm. young people from this class Azúcar. probably know. Sugar. <laughs> <laughs> so, Celia Cruz tenía como esa, esa frase. Ella siempre se excusaba y decía, my English isn't very my good English looking. No, very looking. <laughs> yes. Y very yeah. good looking se usa para, o sea, como características físicas. Pero ella quería decir que su inglés no era muy atractivo. So she said, my English yeah. isn't very good looking. Yeah. <laughs> It was funny. She was really funny. Okay, my dear students, enjoy your dinner, rest, recover, charge your batteries, and I see you tomorrow. See you last tomorrow. Bye. 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 And I have another oh class. My <laughs> no, take care. Bye. 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 Bye.